Hello everyone. We are in the middle of the coronavirus pandemic, but there is a bigger crisis that plagues us all. It is the crisis that plagues our planet. The Earth is the third planet from the Sun and it is our only home. And we have to do everything we can to conserve it. Earth Day 2021 is a celebration by EarthDay.org to raise awareness about the Earth and the various crises that plague it. This video was brought to you in order to create that awareness regarding our planet and what you can do to conserve it. Earth Day Earth Day is an annual event on April the 22nd to demonstrate support for environmental protection. First held on April 22, 1970, it now includes a wide range of events coordinated globally by EarthDay.org. The Earth Day 2021 theme is Restore Our Earth and features five primary programs, the Canopy Project, Food and Environment, Climate Literacy, the Global Earth Challenge, and the Great Global Cleanup. History of Earth Day On January the 28, 1969, a well, a well drilled by Union Oil Platform A off the coast of Santa Barbara, California, blew out. More than 3 million gallons of oil spewed, killing more than 10,000 seabirds, dolphins, seals, and sea lions. As a reaction to this disaster, activists were mobilized to create environmental regulation, environmental education, and above all, the celebration that we call Earth Day. EarthDay.org works in countries around the world to drive meaningful action for our planet across these five main issues. Climate action, science and education, people and communities, conservation and restoration, plastic and pollution. Climate action deals with climate and environmental literacy, global earth challenge, regenerative agriculture and other aspects. We need to involve people around the world and educate them with respect to climate change. So therefore, climate and environmental literacy is a very important step in popularizing the need for conservation. We can use the latest scientific technologies to regulate and to conserve the Earth. The Global Earth Challenge uses mobile technology in order to mobilize support and volunteering for the Earth Day observation. Our soil takes a lot of hits from the climate change perspective. Therefore, regenerative agriculture is an important action taken during Earth Day in order to try and save our soil. Animal agriculture is one of the most leading causes behind the behind the destruction of wildlife. So therefore, Footprints for the Future looks in at how we can reduce the impacts of our diet on climate change. Green cities are the future of the world and all local governments across various cities have a big role to play in the Earth Day celebrations forward as well as the future of our planet. Act on climate change, participate in various events which showcase the importance of climate change and take part in activism regarding climate change. Your vote matters. So therefore, in order to bring about legislation and more rulings regarding the safety of our planet, vote Earth on the EarthDay.org platform. When it comes to science and education, literacy is the first and foremost aspect. So climate and environmental literacy is a very important is a very important pillar. Another important pillar is using mobile technology for the global earth challenge. Education should be carried forward to the younger generation 
and so therefore education and action resources must be made available to everyone. Especially for teachers, we need to have state-of-the-art learning materials so that students can understand the scale of the crisis that we are in. In order to bring about future legislations as well as real change on the planet, we need to mobilize the young leaders for the next generation, which are college students. So therefore, EarthDay.org has brought out Mobilize You in order to target college students and make them understand the need for environmental conservation. EarthDay.org is not just for climate activists. It is an opportunity for everyone to contribute. Footprints for the Future is very important as it can give us a variety of impacts across the globe when everyone who is involved takes care of their carbon footprint. Climate and environmental literacy ensures that more people are aware of the situations and crises we are in. Global faiths help in proposing agendas regarding environmental conservation. So working with different faiths around the world to ensure environmental conservation is vital. Educating people on their rights can make them to vote for earth-friendly legislation. People's uprisings as well as constructive work can also help in the development of green cities and also participation in local governments. People must take a proactive approach in order to ensure that education and action resources are available to everyone and are properly used. Artists for the Earth ensure that people around the world are being made constantly aware of the challenges that plague our planet using their art. Sports has also taken a big hit when it comes to environment. So therefore, athletes around the world are also ideal ambassadors for campaigning regarding the Earth crisis. The Great Global Cleanup is a very important as well as innovative idea to ensure that people participate in promoting as well as conserving the Earth. Conservation and Restoration We need to conserve our environment and so therefore conservation and biodiversity is high on the list of agendas for Earth Day 2021. The Great Global Cleanup helps us to mitigate pollution related problems and the Canopy Project aims to restore the canopy and the green cover of the earth. Plastics and pollution are a major hurdle when it comes to environmental conservation. So therefore, legislations and activism regarding the ending of plastic pollution is very important. The people can also take part in the, in the great global cleanup and collect plastic waste and also avoid using more plastic by following the, fa the three R's, reduce, reuse, as well as recycle. Now let's learn more about the Canopy Project, a pioneering project during Earth Day 2021. The Canopy Project improves our shared environment by planting trees across the globe. Since 2010, EarthDay.org has planted tens of millions of trees with the Canopy Project, working worldwide to strengthen communities. Since the beginning of the 20th century, the world's forests have lost about 20% of their coverage. According to the United Nations Food and Agricultural Organization, about 7.3 million hectares, that accounts to 18 million acres of forests, are lost every year. And roughly half of Earth's tropical forests have already been cleared. EarthDay.org recognizes that planting billions of trees around the world is one of the biggest and cheapest ways to take out carbon dioxide from the atmosphere in order to tackle the climate crisis. Not only do forests act as carbon sinks, but they also provide vital habitat for animals and ecological services for humans, such as purifying the air we breathe, as well as regulating local temperatures. 
one of the most innovative ways in which we can contribute to Earth Day and as well as general conservation of the Earth is the great global cleanup. Sign up for a group cleanup where small groups have a big impact on cleaning up a particular area. Even though if you cannot be a part of a group cleanup, you can always do it yourself. Individual cleanups, maybe a lot or a little, is very important in making a difference in the world. Why not try the innovative idea of plogging, where you can hike across your favorite trail and pick up plastic along the way, cleaning up the world and contributing to the great global cleanup. Fast facts about global waste. 270,000 premature deaths are annually caused by uncontrolled burning of household waste. 2 billion people live without any waste collection services. And 79% of all plastics ever produced have accumulated in the natural environment or landfills. Millions of people do participate in World Cleanup Day and National Cleanup Day, and we need to improve upon this by cleaning up every last bit of plastic. You can do that by first reducing your waste while at home. Be judicious about the plastic that you buy and use the three R's effectively in order to stamp out plastic. Tiny but deadly. Cigarette butts are the most commonly polluted plastic objects in the world, so it's very important to avoid cigarettes as they can be beneficial to the environment on one hand and to respiratory health on the other. People can also take action by planting a pollinator garden. Help critters out by planting native plants around your home. Native plants help provide species like insects and birds with food, shelter, and proper habitat to reproduce. Native plants are your best bets as the species in your area are specially adapted to pollinate the plants indigenous to their habitat. Some pollinator favorites include alyssum, basil, the aptly named butterfly bush, fennel, lavender, marigold, oregano, verbena, and yarrow. Be a bee's best friend by planting native blooming plants. Lavender is a great addition to a pollinator garden as well as for sachets. To know more about Earth Day 2021, join the movement and sign up with earthday.org. Every day is Earth Day for us and therefore we should be aware of this mentality and strive towards keeping the Earth a better place to live in. Join the Earth Day movement. This video is brought to you by Brain Blitz Audios. We are a YouTube channel that provides educational content. But also due to our conscience, we have also decided to create a lot of awareness content regarding various health issues as well as environmental issues. To know more about our channel, you can always hit the link www.youtube.com slash c slash brain blitz audios in order to learn more. So until the next webisode, take care, stay safe, protect the earth, stay aware, bye bye for now.